Hey guys, how's it going? PJX here, and I just wanted to clear up the stupid, uh, that fucking Discord virus that's been being very cancerous to our little mindmen in the community recently. I want to show you guys how to get rid of it. I figured this out yesterday. I couldn't find a video on how to do it or anything. Like, it's like no one even attempted. So I'm going to show you how to remove this. You know the virus that, like, fucking moves your mouse around in the middle of the night, goes to your Skype, and randomly types this link to infect other people with the virus? People think it's a Trojan or some shit? It's a rat, okay? It is something called a rat. And it's very easy to get rid of. It's not really that advanced, it's actually pretty fucking simple. So, you go to your task manager by holding down Control, Alt, and pressing Delete. Or, you can right click your start menu for Windows 10 users and go to Task Manager right here. Okay? Now, you're going to want to uh, press Show All. If that isn't here, you see where it says Fewer Details, More Details, that shit right there? Yeah. You want to do that. Alright, now you want to come up here, you want to go to Startup. See that? Alright, now down here should be some fishy ass fucking program. I'm gonna go look up the name of it in one second. Okay, so it should be called Net Support Client Application, and it should be somewhere here in your startup. So you're gonna look for that. You're gonna right click it when you find it. Of course, I've already gotten rid of it, so I'm gonna give you an example. So when you see the program, the net application thing that I just said, I can't remember already, you're gonna right click it, and you're gonna go to Properties, okay? And you're gonna look down here in General. At the date created. Now, if this was if the program that you right clicked and went to properties is created, it might be named something different. Just look through all of them. If it was created on the exact date that you received the virus, for me, that was the 4th of April, and I found it. It was exactly the right time, 8:27 p.m. on the 4th of April, that it was created. So it's like, okay, well, that's fucking obvious. So what you do when you find that? When you find what program is actually causing it, you right click it, you open file location. Now, once you do that, it should bring you to a very fishy fucking folder called a very fishy thing. And it should be somewhere in your program files or your percent at data percent where your Minecraft folder is, okay? Now, that folder, you want to just delete that thing completely. But it won't let you delete it. And there's a reason why. So, you come back to the task manager before you delete that entire folder. You go to processes. Then, you scroll down here to background processes. You see this? You're going to look down here for the fishy file, the network thing that I just said. It's going to look exactly like the one in your store. Startup and it's going to be somewhere down here on your backs, uh, background processes. So you're going to want to right click it when you find it. I'm just going to give you an example because I deleted it already. So right click that and then you're going to press end task. So it's going to force the program to close. You're going to go back to startup. Click on the fish, right click the fishy fucking thing in startup. Go to open file location. Then you're going to delete the whole folder that it brings up, okay? You're going to like go a step back and delete the whole folder. If you don't want to do that, just delete everything in the folder that it pulls up. Then, you're going to want to make sure that you have right-clicked the program inside of Startup again and pressed Disable on it, okay? You want to make sure this thing is disabled so it can't restart itself and rebuild itself, okay? Now, you're going to want to go and restart your computer. And that is pretty much it, guys. Once you start it back up, you should open Task Manager again, go to Startup, and the file should no longer be here, and your computer will be rat-free from that stupid fucking Discord virus. Alright, guys, thanks for watching, and shout-out to Powera for being my little guinea pig and helping me out with finding a fix for this. So, hope you guys enjoyed, I hope this helped you out, and I will see you guys in the next video. Peace out.